Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to explain part 172 of Java for Tester series. That is using this keyword for differentiating the instance variables of a class from local variables of methods. Okay. In this video session, I am going to explain one of the advantage of using this keyword in Java where what, it, what does this, this keyword will do? It will differentiate the instance variables of the of a class from the local variables of the methods when both of them have the same name okay same names so when the instance variables of the class and local variables of the methods have the same name in that kind of situation java will not be able to understand what is an instance which one is an instance variable and which one is a local variable right for example inside a class for example inside a let's say assume that this is a class guys okay let's say this is a class okay what are instance variables one minute let's assume that this is a class the variables which are directly created under the class are instance variables right let's say there are some instance variables like string car model okay there is an instance variable known as a string car model and similarly there is a method okay let's say there is a method inside this uh, class like this and there's another method uh, another variable with the car model same car model okay same string same car model like this so here what is an instance variable a variable which is directly created under the class is nothing but an instance this is an instance variable guys okay this is an instance variable so what what is the local variable this is the local variable which is inside the method this is a method right so this in inner box is a method let's say and in inside the method there is a variable having the same name as the variable that is directly created under the class okay this is an instance variable whereas this is a local variable okay this one is instance variable which is directly under the class and this is a local variable which is inside the method okay now guys now guys if you are trying to if you have same okay if you have same instance variable in as local variable inside the method okay how to differentiate them they both have the same name instance variable here has the same name and local variable inside the method also has the same name in such kind of cases how to tell java that this is an instance variable and this is a local variable for that we have to use something known as this keyword okay the purpose of the this keyword is to differentiate the instance variables of the class having the same name with the local variables of the methods having the same name okay let me practically show you guys how can how you can use this keyword for differentiating such kind of things okay so let's create uh, let, in this java project let's create a new class i am naming this class as car class click on finish inside this cl car class i'll create the instance variables okay i'm directly creating the variables inside the class okay so i'm just creating some instance variable uh, only one variable i will create for now that is spring let's say car model okay so now i'll create a method guys okay I, in this car class inside this car class i am creating a method public void set details some set details i'm just creating some sample method set details you can give any name guys okay to this method you can give any name to this method that's fine up to you okay i'm just giving set details now here i am creating a local variable inside this method guys that is uh, as parameter i am creating string car model so here this local variable of this method okay this local variable of this method set details the name of this local variable is car model which is of type string and here instance variable is there okay the name is also same that is the local variable name and instance variable name both are car model, car model which are same guys and they are of same string type right this is local variable so in such kind of situations okay in such kind of situations if i assign okay if i if i want to assign this local variable to this instance variable okay i want to assign the value stored in this local variable to the instance variable so what i have to do guys so i will i will copy this car model okay i'm just treating that this is an instance variable and copying this is equal to i will say 
this car model okay this local variable i am copying and pasting here copy and paste in here and put a semicolon so i am just believing that i am assigning the local variable this local variable to this uh, instance variable but that is not happening really okay java is treating both these things as a local variable only okay the left side is also a local variable and right side is also a local variable java is not able to differentiate what is a instance variable and what is a local variable because this instance variable and this local variable both have the same name so java is kind of literally confused so when you double click on this uh, instance variable here car model do you see anything is getting highlighted here any of this uh, the left side and right side variable is highlighting here in this operation no right but when i double click on this uh, local variable car model you see both are there both of this uh, left side and right side are getting highlighted that means both of this are local variables only here in this statement what i am doing is uh, i am assigning the local variable to a local variable i am i just uh, thought like i am assigning the local variable to the instance variable but this is not happening guys when i double click here you see both of them are the local variables am i assigning the same local variable to the same local variable here when i double click on instance you see nothing is getting highlighted so how to tell java that this is an instance variable not a local variable and this is a local variable how to tell java that this is an instance variable how to differentiate the instance variable from the local variable in such kind of situations guys you have to use this dot okay if you say this dot car model okay you are specifically telling java that this is a instance variable okay you see when you double click here this car model is getting highlighted okay or double click here this instance variable is getting highlighted now you are able to tell java that this is not a local variable this is an instance variable now double click on this only one is getting highlighted okay local variable only left side right side one is getting highlighted if you double click on this instance variable you see the the, the variable which is having this this keyword is getting highlighted that means using this keyword i am able to differentiate that differentiate the instance variable from the local variable so this is the purpose guys okay so using this keyword we can differentiate the instance variables of a class from the local variables of the methods okay the variable name variable having the same names as the local variable names when you add this keyword to that that will become the instance variable name okay instance variable fine guys this is how we have to use this keyword for differentiating the instance variable names having the same name as the local variable names of methods okay so that's it guys in the next video session i'll explain another use of this keyword in java okay that is using this keyword for invoking the current class methods okay we can also use this keyword this keyword is not only used for differentiating the instance variables of a class from the local variables of the methods but also this keyword can be used for invoking the current class methods okay i'll show you how to practically use this keyword for invoking the current class methods in the next video session guys so that's it guys see you in the next video session thank you bye